Hello, I am Seamus Dunahoo of EVE University, and this is episode 31 of How to Survive EVE Online. We're going to take on the next step of the uh, military chain, so if you left that window open, just click Request Mission. And we are to destroy a narcotics warehouse and report back to our agent. So let's click Accept. And let's click Close. Again, hitting Alt F to double check everything. Yes, if it's all good. Undock. Right click empty space, cache fill for capsuleers, encounter dead space, warp to location. Warp drive active. Skill training completed. Aha! Uh -huh. Skill training completed. Weapon upgrades reduces the CPU requirement of both turrets and missile launchers. Let's approach the acceleration gate. Let's turn on the afterburner. I don't know if this gate is guarded or not. I guess we'll find out in a moment. Turn off the afterburner. And activate gate. Warp drive active. Alright, the gate is not locked. So to keep this video short, I'm just going to go right on through. The objective is not in this initial area. I'm going to double click over in that direction and turn on the afterburner and hold on I'm not sure if I'm looking at the right thing let me left click this asteroid click look at ah that's the narcotics warehouse let's lock that up and I'm going to right click and reset my camera I'm also going to lock these other enemies turn off the afterburner Reset my camera. Alright, I'm going to open fire on the narcotics warehouse. Control spacebar to stop my ship. Actually, I'm overshooting the target slightly. I'm going to double click in the direction behind me, close some of the distance again, then control spacebar. I'm going to chew up this narcotics warehouse. Now, this mission, if you try to destroy the hostiles, once you've destroyed this first wave of hostiles, more hostiles will show up. Sometimes you can ignore them, sometimes you can't. Basically what I'm doing is called blitzing the mission. I'm going right for the objective, and then I'm going to get out of here. as soon as I blow up the objective. These guys are not doing very much damage to me. Notice that my shields are only down to eh, 200 out of 235. Not very much damage at all. Let's open up your cargo hold. All right, it is now destroyed. You open the cargo container, this is contraband. Look at the skull and crossbones icon in the lower right corner, just above the number 10. And I'm going to reload my weapons while I'm doing this. That icon indicates that it's contraband somewhere. Right click on it, show info. There's a legality tab. Legal implications, Caldari State, Nimitar Republic, Amar Empire, Galente Federation, Jove Empire, Concord Assembly, Amatar Mandate. Uh, this is contraband pretty much in all of high security space. 
So if you try to go through Stargates while carrying this stuff, you are uh, going to have a stern talking to. You're going to have a stern talking to from uh, the NPCs at the Stargates. And you know what? Before I leave... You know what? Open the journal. Cash flow for Capsuleers. Yeah, the objective is complete. You can destroy these guys if you want to. You know how to engage in combat, I trust. So I'm going to keep this video short. I'm going to return to station and turn in the mission. So some missions can be blitzed. Some cannot, and you really do need to destroy all of the hostiles on the field. Do be aware that sometimes trying to shoot a mission objective like that might cause additional hostiles to show up. It depends upon how the mission was programmed into the game. This particular mission, shooting the narcotics warehouse, did not cause hostiles to appear. There is a mission called Break Their Will, if you start working for regular mission, non-tutorial mission agents. There's a mission you might be offered called Break Their Will, where if you start shooting at the you're supposed to destroy a repair station, you warp in, there's nothing there. You start shooting at the repair station, all of a sudden all these pirates show up and start trying to blast your ship into tiny little pieces. So sometimes shooting the mission objective is a trigger for reinforcements to show up, and if you didn't clear out the existing hostiles, then the existing hostiles and the reinforcements together can overwhelm your tank. It'll be far more damage than you could possibly repair through, and you will lose your ship. So some missions are like that, other missions are not. Which actually reminds me, uh, when you finish with the tutorial chain and you get out into the wider world of EVE, there is a website I want you to know about. Uh, no, not EVEgate. Uh, HTTP colon slash slash www period eve hyphen survival period org this is a guide to all sorts of player versus environment content uh, you'll probably when you start running missions for regular mission agents that is you're not doing the tutorial stuff anymore and you're not uh, you'll want to go look up the name of the mission that you're being offered in the mission index and read about it and there's information on all sorts of missions. Right? You should probably read the mission you're being offered before you actually go out on the mission. That way you know how to prepare yourself. Uh, in the next episode, we are going to take on what I believe is the... Oh, I didn't turn in this mission yet, did I? Complete the mission. In the next episode, we will take on the last step of this mission chain. In the meantime, thank you for watching.